<laughs> the Battle of Stonington. Four gallant ships from England came, freighted deep with fire and flame, and other things we need not name to have a dash at Stonington. Now safely moored, the work begun, they thought to make those Yankees run and have a mighty deal of fun in stealing sheep from Stonington. The Yankees too, their fort repaired and made as though they little cared for all that came, though very hard the cannon played on Stonington. For the bombardiers with bomb and ball soon made a farmer's hayrick fall and did a cow house sadly maul that stood a mile from Stonington. They killed a goose, they killed a hen, three hogs they wounded in a pen. They dashed away and pray what then this was not taking Stonington. For the bombs were thrown, the rockets flew, but not a shell of all they threw. Though every house was in full view, could burn a house in Stonington. To have their say, they thought but fair, so the Yankees brought two guns to bear. And sir, it would have made you stare to see that smoke at Stonington. For they board one ship clear through and through, and killed or wounded of her crew. So many that she bade adieu to the gallant boys of Stonington. The British ships gave up the fray, and with their comrades they sneaked away. Such was the valor of that day of British tars at Stonington. But some assert on certain grounds, besides the damage and the wounds, it cost the king 10,000 pounds to have a dash at Stonington. They say it cost the king 10,000 pounds to have a dash at Stonington.